Hello everyone. Are you ready for NQDT series? Your will be a CAT, your MAT examination. Many of you must have been preparing for the examination like these NQDT series, your will be a CAT, MAT. So where is the problem? Actually, uh, for the last few days, I have been getting a lot of uh, queries from the end of the students. Okay, sir, close test, how to tackle it? Let's make a video up. Banai. Now, guys, your waiting period is over. I'm Elanjan Bosch, the professor of Simesh College, and this time I'm going to present an important session related to closed test. Let me tell you one thing, that why are you having fear in your mind regarding closed test? Kya aapko samajh mein nahi aata hai? Closed test mein approach kaise kiya jai? Frankly speaking, this closed test is an integral part of many of the competitive examination. If I'm talking about NQDT, CSE, or Will, CAT, or MAT, of course, the questions appear regarding this particular section, right? So, problem kahan pe hota hai? Aaj ka is video ki maadham se aapko hum uh, is idea dene ki koshish karenge ki closed test mein aapka approach kya hoga. But before doing that, I would uh, like to let you know that what is closed test? Pahle ye to ek idea aapke dimaag mein aajai ki closed test actually hota kya hai? Why is it conducted? Now, uh, there are several aspects uh, why the competitive examinations include the questions regarding closed test. And I'm quite sure that at the end of the session, uh, you will be in a better position to deal with the questions regarding closed test. So this time, you people are going to practice with me. And at the end of the session, you will be in a better position. Right? So let's this video without wasting time. Look, first thing is that, that comes to my mind, that why closed tests are conducted. There are three different objectives. Let me talk about the first one, that is comprehend the context. It is it is the kind of verbal assessment test which actually uh, uh, focuses on comprehending the contextual meaning. Aapka, kain bhi student ka, agar kisi bhi students ka man mein agar ye ek uh, idea a jai, ki closed test is all about testing your vocabulary. No, you are quite mistaken. Closed tests are not only conducted uh, with a view of uh, uh, focusing vocab section, but actually at the same time, it is going to test your three different sections. First one is whether you are understanding the contextual meaning. Second one, it will definitely test your vocabulary. And last one, that is the most important section according to me. And then that is grammatical aspects. Why am I saying like that? Ye question aapko samaj mein nahi hai, right? Okay, fine. Look, a small passage if it's given in the form of the question, there are several lines in the uh, particular passage. You have to go through all the lines and you need to understand that what is the meaning of this particular passage. Once it comes to your mind, you will be in a better position to deal with the questions, going through the options, right? And vocab, yeah, it, it of course, it plays an important or integral part in the English section. But okay, fine, if you do not uh, have any idea of a particular word, you should not consume a lot of time over that. Rather, you should be adopting the elimination technique and you will definitely, if you understand that what is the meaning of this particular sentence, of course, you can easily get to know that what should be the correct option. And last segment, that is the, not the least and the most important, and that is grammar. Now, you should have some grammatical concepts under your custody. Otherwise, it will be really, really difficult for you. Let me tell you. So, चलिए आज का इस क्लोज टेस्ट का जो भी ऑब्जेक्टिव है इसके बारे में हम लोग डिस्कशन तो कर चुके हैं नाउ विदाउट हैविंग एनी प्रैक्टिस हाउ कुड यू बी हाउ विल यू बी एबल टू अंडरस्टैंड दैट कैसे मेरा अप्रोच होना चाहिए किस तरीके से हम आगे प्रोसीड करें राइट सो लेट्स सॉल्व एन एक्सरसाइज हियर कम्स अ क्वेश्चन Okay, fine. Let me go through the sentences first. And after that, I will let you know that what should be the correct answer. The dash of technology has transformed the way we dash. Look, here we technology ke baare mein baat kar Of course, you are quite sure that first sentence mein jo transformation ke baare mein baat ki hai, technology ke baare mein baat ki hai. Ye technology ka evolution hua, fir transformation ko lae, aur uske baad kis be ye benefit diya communication process pe. It's a, it's a logical sequence, right? So, aapka, if you go through the option, the first option it is evolution, after that invention, then comes discovery, and last one extinction. If I go through all the options of uh, one, then definitely the last option it should be straight away eliminated because it's not talking about extinction right now you can be confused in between the uh, options like uh, evolution or invention 
fine once uh, something has been started and after that it is getting evolved or uska outcome nikalta hai kuch positive ya negative right so here we are talking about the evolution of technology technology kaise evolve kiya aur uske baad kya bol raha hai yahan pe ki transform me transform the way of kya transformation kiya कम्युनिकेशन का बिकॉज अब देखो इसके बाद नेक्स्ट लाइन पे लिखा हुआ है विद द डैश ऑफ स्मार्टफोन्स एंड सोशल मीडिया स्टेइंग कनेक्टेड विद फ्रेंड्स एंड फैमिली हैज नेवर बीन इजियर फ्रॉम दिस पर्टिकुलर लाइन आपके दिमाग में हिट करना चाहिए इट्स टॉकिंग अबाउट कम्युनिकेशन प्रोसेस सो द सेकंड ब्लैंक विल बी कम्युनिकेट एंड द फर्स्ट वन इट विल बी इवोल्यूशन सो द इवोल्यूशन ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी हैज ट्रांसफॉर्म द वे वी कम्युनिकेट फाइन सो फर्स्ट एंड सेकेंड ब्लैंक्स आर ऑलरेडी डन Now let us move to the third one. With the dash of smartphones and social media, staying connected with friends and family has never been easier. Up is me. Let us go through the next set of options so that you can be pretty sure that what should be there in the slot. So going through the options, the first option it is written prevalence. After that, uh, decline, then dominance, and last one absence. Now going through the line, if you if you focus on the uh, three third blank with the dash of smartphones and social media, staying connected with friends and family has never been easier. अब देखिए यहाँ पे आपको decline decline के बात तो कर नहीं रहे हैं यहाँ dominance के factor यहाँ बात नहीं कर रहे हैं और absence अगर होगा तो social media या smartphone ये जो है staying connected कैसे हो सकता है? so all the negative words will be eliminated and you should go for the positive one and it should be prevalence prevalence matlab jo prachalit hai jo chal raha hai market mein right so with the prevalence of smartphones and social media staying connected with friends and family has never been easier so third blank it will be filled by the word the first option of three and that is prevalence right let us move to the next segment however this dash convenience also brings its own set of challenges अब इसका लुक दिस इज द ट्रांजिशन वर्ड दैट इज कॉल्ड हाउ एवर नाउ दूसरा एंगल से अब बात करने की कोशिश किया जा रहा है राइट हाउ एवर दिस डैश कन्वीनियंस ऑल्सो ब्रिंग्स इट्स ओन सेट ऑफ चैलेंजेस नाउ फोर में अगर हम लोग जाएंगे अगर आउटडेटेड हो जाता है सेकेंड ऑप्शन पे अगर फोकस करें हम लोग आउटडेटेड तो ये कन्वीनियंस की बात तो नहीं करता राइट सो आउटडेटेड विल बी एलिमिनेटेड ऑप्सोलेट का कोई जगह नहीं बनता है क्योंकि ऑप्सोलेट इज एब्सोल्यूटली नेगेटिव वर्ड एंड इज टॉकिंग अबाउट द पॉजिटिव वन नेक्स्ट वन लास्ट वन दर इज मॉडर्न ओके इट कैन बी बट दिस मॉडर्न कन्वीनियंस ऑल्सो ब्रिंग्स इट्स ओन सेट ऑफ चैलेंजेस ये मॉडर्न यहां यूज करोगे या ऑप्शन ए न्यू फाउंड एज वी हैव ऑलरेडी टॉक्ट अबाउट दैट इट इज द इवोल्यूशन ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी नंबर ऑफ टाइम्स सोशल मीडिया की बात किए हम लोग तो स्मार्टफोन की बात किए तो ऑफ कोर्स यहां पे न्यू फाउंड कन्वीनियंस बिकॉज अर्लियर इट इज नॉट यूज टू बी पहले इस तरह से कोई आपका कन्वीनियंस नहीं मिला करता था बट येस दिस इज द रिसेंट वन सो दिस न्यू बॉर्न न्यू फाउंड कन्वीनियंस ऑल्सो ब्रिंग्स इट्स ओन सेट ऑफ चैलेंजेस क्योंकि न्यू तरीके से इस चीज को पाया gaya in that case your correct answer will be option a and that is new found right many people find it dash to disconnect from their devices and enjoy quality dash with loved ones now for that you require the set of options and here it comes so going through all the options of five that is easy difficult impossible and useful now getting back to the question many people find it dash to disconnect from their devices and enjoy quality dash with the loved ones so what will you uh, suggest over there yahan pe kya easy ko favor karenge ya hum impossible ko karenge ya useful ko karenge fine yahan pe agar aap sentence ko gaur karo many people find it useful to disconnect from their devices ya easy to disconnect from their devices yahan pe baat kar rahe hain zyada easier ho gaya hai so correct answer will be many people find it easy to disconnect from their devices and enjoy quality now moving through or going through all the options of six solitude interaction serenity and distraction once you were talking about the disconnection of course it is talking about the interaction right so quality interaction with the loved ones if you if you want to talk to you the uh, to your loved ones of course you should focus on communication process and that is all about the interaction so six blank will be filled by the word like interaction and the five and the fifth one will be easy right so we are done with five and six so we are left with only three seven eight nine and for that you require set of options let me proceed to that
So now moving through the line, finding a dash between the benefits of technology and real world. So up here, technology or real world ke beech mein balance ki baat kar rahe So it should be balance. Find the balance between benefits of technology and real world. Dash can be a key to a balanced and dash life. It's talking about the balance, right? So option, uh, sorry, blank S will be filled up by the word like balance. Now moving to eight. Between the real uh, benefits of technology and real world, dash can be a key to a balance. Now, moving through all the options or going through all the options, it's isolation, connection, separation, and distance. It should be talking about the connection. So, between the benefits of technology and real world connection can be a key to a balanced and what kind of life it is talking about. Balanced and what life? It cannot be hectic. It cannot be unbalanced. It cannot be disorganized because last blank is talking about the positive one. Key to a balanced and balanced life. It's talking about the balanced life. Okay, correct. So your uh, option, uh, sorry, uh, fill uh, gap number seven. It should be filled up by the word like balance. And gap number eight, it should be filled up by the word like connection. And the last one, it should be balanced and uh, balanced life. What kind of life we are talking about through this particular passage? It is just trying to create the balanced life. So the correct answer will be balanced. So my dear students, I have tried my level best to give you some idea that what should be your ideal approach uh, to uh, attack the questions of close test. And mind it, the close test section plays a really, really important role in terms of competitive examination because it is going to test, once again, I just uh, I just uh, uh, tell you that uh, it is going to test your comprehending ability, its contextual meaning, understanding power and vocab and Finally, it should be all about the game of grammar, my dear students. So you should be quite sure that keep on practicing. You you'll need a lot of practice. Keep on practicing and definitely you will come up with flying colors. It's uh, quite obvious from mind, right? So uh, I'm quite sure that all of you must have understood whatever has been presented today by me. Uh, and you have practiced uh, a particular passage in the form of closed test. And I have already told you that what should be the ideal approach to eliminate the options and to get to know that what should be the correct option. So that's all from my side today and keep on watching the next uh, the, the coming videos because all the videos are going to be really really crucial for you in terms of competitive examination all the students who are preparing for nqd tcs uh, cat mat yeah will and these kind of examination a uh, closed test is a very very important segment so in the coming videos of course there will be something new for you and you yeah I, I, it's it's a, a request from mine to all of you that you should try to extract maximum from all these videos. Thank you so much. Take care. Bye-bye.